All right, what's good y'all? Sog here, here with a tutorial video for Halloween. Isn't that nice? But uh, this video is for the people that got a Rift Master, like me, decided to just plug in the dongle, turn on the controller, get on Clone Hero, and uh, whenever you move the uh, little buttons, move the fret, all that stuff, nothing's happening, nothing's going on. I don't know if you can hear my fret here with my noise suppression, but yeah, nothing's happening. So what you wanna do is I'm just gonna, just gonna Alt F4 on Clone Hero here. And what you want to do is that I'm going to put two links in the description. And what you want to do is you want to install two .exes. One being RB4 Instrument Mapper and one being Vigum Bus. Install the latest version for these for RB4. Right now there's a pre-release. Personally, I'd go with the latest version instead of pre-release just in case if there's any issues. But you might be looking at this um, RB4. That's uh, that's Rock Band 4. That shouldn't be a thing. Trust me, this is going to work. Click. Just, I'm just going to go through the standard installation process just in case if people that aren't tech literate can follow along. But you click more info here. Run anyways. This isn't a bad file or anything. Trust me. A lot of people use this. Hit run anyways. Go through all this agreement stuff. I agree to the license. Install. A little pop-up will pop up to, do you allow this app? Click yes. I know the screen went black there, but should pop up yes for you. All right, once it's installed here, you can close it and then go install Vigum Bus, which it's pretty much the same thing. You agree. In terms of service, you can mess with the install file if you want. doesn't really matter. Another pop-up will pop up saying if you allow this app to make changes, click yes, and then it should install things in a short amount of time. All right, once it's finished, you can close all this and what you want to do is type up RB4 instrument mapper. Eventually it'll pop up. There we go. And then you want to go to capture emulation mode. Click on that. Click on Vigum bus. I don't know what this RPC S3 compatibility is. It probably is for the other rock band controllers, but click on Vigum bus. And my controller's on. Let me just turn it off just to kind of give you an example of what will happen once you click start here. So I have my controller off now. I'm turning it on. And once it turns on, you'll eventually get the little message here. Create new Rift Master uh, Vigum map for the... I cannot speak. But yeah, all these notifications will pop up. That doesn't matter. But what does matter is if it works or not. So... If we open up Clone Hero, everything should work now. And if I press the little three lines, this is for the Xbox Rift Master, by the way, if I hit the three lines here, I hit the start button. Look at that. Now I can look through all of the beautiful songs that I have and play like it's a guitar. Look at that. I'm absolutely horrible playing with a guitar controller so that's why a lot of my songs have no scores on them or very crappy scores but uh if y'all find this found this helpful leave a like and subscribe if you have any questions leave them in the comments below i'll try and answer anything if i have the knowledge for that rock out with your cock out and peace out